Today we're counting down five new TV shows and movies coming out in November that feature queer women in them. Coming out November 5th is Dickinson Season 3. I want to do something that matters. This is Dickinson's last season, which makes me so sad, but I'm really, really excited to see this last season. And I'm hoping season three is what I had hoped season two was gonna be. I was a little disappointed watching season two, though by the end of it, I thoroughly enjoyed it. <laughs> but yeah, I'm super, super excited to see my girls back on the screen again. This is releasing on Apple TV. Also coming out on November 5th is Tampa Bay's on Amazon Prime. The lesbian scene in Tampa. It's definitely close knit. Everybody knows everybody. Everybody's dated everybody. Now this is a um, reality TV show of sorts. It gives me the real L word vibes. If anyone ever saw that show, I feel like it only went for like a season or two. That was messy. <laughs> I feel like this is gonna be just as messy. And of course, I'm gonna be watching it. So Tampa Bay's is releasing November 5th on Amazon Prime. Coming out November 10th on Netflix is the film Passing. Pardon me, I don't mean to stare, but I think I know you. Claire? Mm -hmm. Now, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not 100% sure if we're gonna get any queer content on the passing. I get like the vibes, I'm getting vibes, and I don't know if it's just me wishful thinking, but I'm gonna be watching it and seeing if passing lives up to my hopes and dreams, though I, I, I don't know, I'm nervous. <laughs> I do believe passing is already out in some theaters around the world, but it's releasing November 10th on Netflix. Returning November 16th on The CW is Riverdale. Kev found something in the woods. This is Cheryl. It's gotta be. I am not a fan of Riverdale. I think I watched the first episode and that was it for me. So this one's obviously not for me, but for those that do enjoy Riverdale, um, it's coming back to your screens November 16th. Coming out November 18th on HBO is The Sex Lives of College Girls. Wait, is this a walk of shame? I mean, is it a walk of shame if I stayed up all night in the library hooking up with my textbook? Like, ah. Now, again, I'm not sure if this series is uh, gonna feature any queer women in it, but I'm kind of hoping. I'm kind of hoping there's enough women in the main cast that we at least get one of them being queer. <laughs> Though the trailer does look very uh, hetero, <laughs> so we'll see. Also returning from last month, we have NCIS Hawaii, New Amsterdam, Station 19, Grey's Anatomy, The Morning Show, Nancy Drew, Batwoman, Supergirl, Legends of Tomorrow, I Know What You Did Last Summer. All these shows feature queer women in them and are currently airing through November as well. So that's my list for the month of November. If you know of any other shows, let us know in the comments below. Otherwise, we will see you in my next video. Okay, bye.